Hi everyone, welcome to the SOPIA tutorial session 8. So in this tutorial, I'll be discussing about the service mapping for the virtualization in SOPIA. So first, let me tell you what is uh, service mapping. So before actual web service comes to the picture or handy, we use basically mock, right? So we can say the service mocking or the virtualization is a practice of creating the facsimile environment that works similar to the real environment. Suppose web service has not been implemented for uh, some other resources. Okay, so suppose web service has given for some uh, particular domain, uh, and we want the web service that is to be applicable for some other domain also, but it is yet to be implemented in the next release. Okay, now you want to start writing your test script or test case. So in that case, service mocking or the virtualizations will help. So you can start writing your test script or test cases, and when the actual environment the real environment will be handy so you can just import all those cases and start doing your testing okay so let's have a look into it how we can configure and we will go to the details okay okay so let me show you guys how i'm using currently version sophia 5.2.1 and uh, the project the medical supplier uh, i'm going to create mock service for this project the wsbl file has been provided Okay, and inside that you can see there is two interfaces and two bindings actually that medical supply soap and medical soap tool. And for the bindings, we are having several operations like get supply by city, get supply by supply type, and zip code. And for each and every operations, we are having soap request to send. Okay, so if you send the request by this way, by I'm choosing the CTC, I will click on the send button. So it will list out all the supplier uh, for this, for this, uh, I mean. City. Okay, okay. Choose different one. California and click on send request. And I, I should be getting all the supplier name along with the company address name for the city California. Okay. So the thing is that this web service has been implemented for uh, the US city only. Now suppose I want to implement the same for the other country. Okay. So other country city should be there. Suppose uh, let me provide it here Mumbai. If I click on that, it's uh, not implemented as of now. So I should be getting records as zero, and there is no data should be displayed. Now I want to create one uh, mock service. I want to generate. I want a response to. I mean the real web services yet to develop. And I want to test the service for the same. So for that, I need to create one mock services. I will mock the response, and I will be searching with the city Mumbai. It will. Uh, it will show us the response okay uh, let me just show you so first suppose mumbai i want to get uh, so what one are we gonna do first we're gonna have to create mock service for this so create on the right click on that and check these options generated soap mock services now for which operation you want to do like suppose for the get supply by city operation i'm doing currently so check on that only Port by default it is exaggerated. You can choose a different port also and start the mock service immediately. If you want to start, click on that, else don't require. I'm not checking on that currently. This is the mock service path, make sure of that. This will be required uh, when you will be providing as the endpoint. So just click on the OK. Okay, the mock service name. The mock service name provide we have to provide. So just name it as a mock service, mock service, mock service. Okay. So now we can see this is the mock service window is opened and if you see the settings it's a path and the port and a host everything is getting displayed okay and the fault operations for only this the operations will list it we can check on that i just click keep it as of now and so far we have created the response the response is we are getting this is a blank response obviously right now suppose we want to get the supply number for uh, mumbai city i want to get okay so get supply number. So get supply number like it's A Z J P U two three four six and company name X Y Z E E T limited. Okay. And address um address some I mean the main point uh street C G three two three Something I'm giving the city as Mumbai State Maharashtra. The zip code, let me put it something. Telephone. 
this is the dummy data i am providing okay for checking the uh, uh, for testing our uh, um, for testing our uh, request response okay so mock sabi while we needing while we checking response that for that request that is yet to develop or yet to implement when it will be developed for mumbai then you can directly do it okay the descriptions this medicine house i'm providing is supply participating yes i just delete uh, you can just keep that option or delete the options option of uh, that sort of thing so guys the benefit is that when your service is here to level up or suppose you want to test for the city the currently this uh, project is containing for only the city uh, uh, inside usa okay now i want to do it for the indian city so that's why i'm creating a mock service so i'm mocking all those things and generating the response then i'll be running our test suite utilizing the mock service and port okay okay this is enough uh, now first i have to create one so mock service and now i have to create one uh, test cases okay for the request one uh, add to the test case for i want to add suppose the client to a new test suite so test suite 2 test case 1 and check all the salient uh, so responses assessors okay so test suite has been created successfully and said that test case 1 created uh, inside the test step there is one show request has been there if you just uh, if you use the endpoint this way okay just click on that we will be getting zero zero right so now i want to use the endpoint as 8080 8080 is a mock medicare supply soap that i have uh, currently just uh, created okay so for that if you just want to run it uh, change i mean uh, select the endpoint just click on run you will get there is currently zero soap i mean let me show you yeah there is currently zero running sopia mock services so first we have to create the run the mock server, mock server. So that is um, one more thing important guys where the mock service by default run on the jetty server okay so it will by default run on the jetty server uh, so let me open the mock service port has been given that is the port i'm accessing just click on hit on the start mock services so the mock server will be started on 8088 it is by default will be on the jetty server okay so mock service is running so if i give the more city as a mumbai and click on uh, submit request so see i should be getting exactly the details this means just disable this as of now we don't need to so we'll check it later so this is the request i am getting for a city mumbai so see i mean i am getting the supply request as well all the things that i am getting probably in city mumbai if you was change your uh, change it to kolkata uh, so what you will get what you should get actually yeah, ex exactly okay if you change it to kolkata by default still you will get only this response because this response has been mocked successfully for for city mumbai so if you change anything in the request you only get the that response that has been mocked okay so this is uh, that's how we can utilize the mock service for generate mock for such uh, web services that is yet to implement okay one more thing guys uh, uh, now suppose uh, let me just stop it so i have i have edited those data right i have edited those data why it was blank initially now I, now you want to do uh, first i will run it for boston For Boston City, and now I want this only. That this request, I'm, 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 I'm wanting this to be as a, added as a mock service step. So we can directly add it to it. Add to mock service we have already added before. Now add as a mock response step. Okay, we can directly do it. So if you add mock response step, and wherever it's located, um, test case customer not not here. Uh, so test suite, test case 1, uh, okay. 
So see if I see, check, click on that. If I click on that, this is the response uh, for uh, for Boston only. Okay, but let me do it one thing like whatever the mock response created, uh, so can just uh, remove it as of now. Initially, this is fine. Uh, we'll just uh, that part. I want to add as a I want to add this as a mock service. Mock service one will possibly test. Okay, okay, this is fine. So what I basically done, I just click on that and I don't add it as a step. Rather, I I want to add it as a mock service. So I added this mock service and the response I'm seeing. The response I am not I, I I don't need to edit the response by default it's showing for Boston okay so just now just the same way we have done before if I just uh, run the mock server start up variable start on it's rate is showing okay uh, starting on the server already in use showing okay so some other port is listening already just let me change the server it's rate seven click on okay click on run it's running on port zero eight seven let me take you to my request and now I have to choose 8087. The endpoint is 8087. Okay. So, server is running. If I click on continue button, you see the response I am getting for Boston City. Okay. Okay. So whatever the city will provide, uh, something, whatever you will provide, you should be getting response for Boston city only. City name is Boston. Why? Because I have taken the uh, taken the uh, response for this particular request and added it as a mock response step. So either you can directly add the response to your mock service or you can uh, take one blank response and edit, edit whatever you want. Okay. So um, for uh, project purpose, you will be using this blank. And then you need then you need to add whatever uh, the requirement is there, and accordingly you need to modify all those things and add it to the mock server, mock uh, mock response step. Okay. So guys, uh, that's all for today. We have seen that how we can utilize the mock service for uh, testing application that is testing web services basically that is get to implement, and utilizing the mock service we can test those things like for whatever I, earlier I have shown you for if I search on Mumbai. And it was displaying for all details of the Mumbai, and we can just put some assertion it is coming properly or not. Everything we can just uh, test the application before it's coming to handy. Okay, so that's the utilization of uh, mock service that we will be using uh, in SOAP UI. Okay, so thanks, thank you guys for watching this video.